You know, Pioneer Day brings thousands of out-of-towners as well into the valley. That means more money for the local economy. But we found out just how much of a boost depends on who you ask. ABC4's Mark Zinni is also live at Liberty Park with more on the financial fireworks from the festivities. Mark? Yeah, hey there, Karen and Ross. Obviously, right now, the fireworks show continuing, and that's really what it's all about right now. A lot of people turning out throughout the day, throughout the week, as a matter of fact, making it a pretty successful day, to say the least. But some local retailers telling ABC4 they now question if this boom will be short-lived. The days of 47 Rodeo bucking tradition and moving to the East Center in West Valley City this year. That has been a benefit to nearby hotels. Uh, you know, there's a court over here. Uh, it's on the top. Like the country and in suites, where the check-ins continue for families who try not to miss the fun. Pretty, Pretty much. much. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we miss once in a while, but we come up for the rodeo. The hotel owner says yes. They've been booked all week with the rodeo in the days of 47 parade. But overall, business is actually down. Salt Lake City, uh, it's about 15% down. Overall, the city. Of course, the Pioneer Day Parade brings tens of thousands of people downtown, but this year it coincided with the outdoor retailer summer trade show. Several hotel managers telling ABC4 they filled up this week for both when they could have benefited twice if the trade show was held later. It's going to be a little weaker mm -hmm. because the outdoor retailer, it happened already. The owner of K Rico Restaurante on 21st South has other worries tonight. I'll be honest with you, the economy is killing us. For the first time, he opened a stand for Pioneer Day where he says he was told to plan on 90,000 hungry people. But he says it was so slow today he dropped his prices. And despite conventions and parades, it's no better at his downtown restaurant. We went down from $800 a day to $150 to $50. One day we did $28. One day. Now the Salt Lake City Chamber is not putting a dollar amount on how much money Pioneer Day, ge Day generates, but a spokesperson says anytime you bring this many people, of course, into the downtown area, into the Salt Lake City area, they're going to obviously spend money, and that is certainly a good thing for the community. We are live downtown, right in the heart of the fireworks show. Mark Zinni, ABC4 News. All right, Mark, thanks very much.